Hello, and welcome back to Furry Meme Review. I'm your host, the bear who will always be forever single. Let's go get some memes. The perfect gift for your single friend. Why is this the first thing that pops up when I went to Furry IRL? Why do I want it? Has my, has my loneliness evolved to the point where I would just settle for a, a gigantic plushie of a bear? It doesn't even look like a bear. It looks like someone decapitated a human and also decapitated <laughs> a teddy bear and just lumped them all together like a freaking hybrid. What is this? Why do I want it? I want it. I want to be that lady. Yeah. Oh boy. I sure do love watching this show from the 1970s and 90s. Culturally insensitive or politically incorrect joke. <gasps> oh, the audacity. <gasps> Yeah, here's the thing though. <laughs> um, this shows like this are a product of their time, especially if you're talking about the 1970s. Okay, the 1970s from the 60s, 70s, it's strife with uh, racial, po racial and political um, battles, wars, everything. And what were you pretty much expecting? You know, it. <laughs> why are you surprised? They are a product of their time. You don't, you don't have to like it. Also, I don't, by the way, I don't condone stuff like this, okay? But still, you don't have to be that surprised. It's a product of their time. Bro, that's not a furry. A furry is someone in a costume pretending to be a furry. Context, he's talking about Chai is the furry scientist. I don't even know what they're talking- well, Bro, that's not a furry. A furry is someone in a costume pretending to be a furry. What? How to summon a crowd? Random German noises. Moin, hallo, servus. Du hast nach mir gerufen. Du, du hast, du hast mich, du hast mich, du hast mich gefragt, du hast mich gefragt, du hast mich gefragt, am mich dann nicht dir sagt. You, if you guys have no idea what the fuck I just said a few seconds ago, we can't be friends. Okay, if you cannot jam with the Rammstein, we cannot be friends. I'm so sorry, that's the rose. Eating Burger King like he didn't just rearrange my, my guts five minutes ago in the bathroom. <laughs> Which bathroom? Burger King's bathroom or your bathroom? Because <laughs> if you're trashy enough to post this on the internet, I feel like you're trashy enough to be, to be having sex in the ba in the Burger King bathroom. Not, not, not judging you, but... It's sort of the energy that you're putting out, and I'm just describing it. I'm so sorry. <laughs> I, w I would, I would pay to have someone rearrange my guts. Not in the, not in the Burger King bathroom, mind you, but you know, some were a bit more comfortable and less likely to get us arrested. <laughs> I'll never find Andrews attractive, and then it's got Judy Hops, uh, that one bitch from FNAF, and uh, Diane. Oh my god, so sexy! And it's just a bunch of birds, and a dragon, and Luna! I feel like people like this cherry pick more than corrupt televangelists on television when they try to cherry pick the Bible when it comes to their agendas. I feel like that happens a lot. Oh! Okay, um... Astucia de mama. Astucia evolucionada. Zoro. Zoro evolution. Quit, quit the manchas, and it's <laughs> is this Nick Wilde's less success, less um, well not less, okay. Uh, this is this Nick Wilde's um, slightly successful cousin, <laughs> big, big Glild. <laughs> Damn, I'm tired. You should sleep more then. No, not tired. Oh, no, sleep only tired. <laughs> All right. Uh, I'm gonna be a bit real with you guys, okay? I actually started sleeping more, all right? And I feel much better for it. The problem is, if I sleep, I will miss the upload schedule that I've set my for my, my channel, all right? Uh, you noticed that uh, last, uh, I'm sorry, yesterday's um, video came out a little bit late. Actually, not late. It's three hours late. Alright, it's uh, it was supposed to come out 12 midnight my time, but of course I got to sleep. I feel I feel a little bit better for it, but now my uh, 
<laughs> my views are gonna get tanked because it my my upload schedule has changed so rapidly. So yeah, there's that. I feel so much better, but now my uh, my upload schedule is and my views are going to shit. Uh -huh. This should lighten things up at work. Uh -huh. Is that a flashbang? I thought it was a horseradish because of the holes, but apparently it's a flashbang. Yeah, <laughs> you're bringing this to work, you detonate it, and everything is now glowing, and there's a ringing in your ears, and it would make it harder for your boss to fire you because everyone can't hear anything because of the shit you just pulled. Hey Zeph, can you toss me a bagel? Sure! Blink, yeet, incoming! <laughs> why are you like this? <laughs> why ask why she's like that when you can go? We can you two, you two can go to a carnival with the ring toss thing, and you can basically win every single stuffed toy that they have and sell it for prof for profit. Why can't you just do that? You know, it's, it, it, she has a skill. You need to exploit it and make money. All right, so. If you give me a pizza box, I expect it to have pizza, alright? And if I open the pizza and I find a salad, you best believe that I won't fucking eat it. I was expecting the Italiana goodness of pizza and you give me the blandness of American salads. I mean, I, I have no uh, nothing against salads. I would eat that too, but you know, I, I, I want pizza, damn it. Give me the pizza. Fun fact with Retro. If anti-furries are primarily more focused on targeting furries because of who they are, then they are completely obsessed with us. And if they're so obsessed with furries, they might as well become furries. Big brain a moment. It's, I've always said this a lot. It's always the most homophobic, the most hateful, the most hate-filled uh, political person that advocates against homosexuality. And it's always them that are caught in motels having sex with a gay prostitute. It's always them. And it's the same for furry haters. Alright? They have they're so into the furry closet that Aslan is telling them to get the fuck out of there because they've been in there for so long they're not even paying rent. <laughs> they, that, is, that is that is how in the closet they are. My god. Oh, hey, what's up? I've been gay for you since you first showed up. Oh, that's that's quite a bomb to drop. You you couldn't have said something about it sooner. I can't tell if he's disappointed or flustered. I feel like it's the same. It's, it's both. I feel like it's both. Yeah, it's both. It's pretty much both. When you're laid down in a warm bed after a cold day outside, I can't relate. This is a tropical country. This is the Philippines. It's hotter than Satan's ass in summer. This, this country has two settings, hot and cold, nothing else. There's nothing in between, all right? Everything is hot is either hot or cold, and they fucking hate it. And that, my friends, is where I will leave you. Thank you guys so much for watching today's video, and um, that's pretty much it. <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed take care you guys and please make sure to like and subscribe share this video any way you can because again YouTube is targeting my channel for uh, low view count the algorithm has completely changed now they don't like hold of the lamb anymore so yeah I hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you guys again in the next video stay foxy much love